My God, take a look at that future. Ladies and gentlemen, officially this is a brand new 2017 KTM Duke 390 showcased in ECMA 2016 motorcycle show in Milan. Looks like a baby of a Super Duke, doesn't it? It totally seems to be a tweak as compared to the previous Duke 390 and believe me guys, this is more or less like a love it or hate it kind of game according to the looks. Well, if you ask me, I remember when Duke was launched in India for the first time, people gave the similar kind of reaction until it got digested and now look at it. It is one of the highest selling bikes in the country, right? So I would say I will digest the looks because there is more under the hood that meets the eye. Well, remember my video a couple of months ago? Uh, well, I'm glad that most of the changes that I had mentioned in the vlog are on board now. So what exactly are the changes we are talking about? Well, the biggest change is cosmetic and the new model getting new bodywork and new design with aggressive styling inspired by the Super Duke. So we have got new split headlight, revised fuel tank, exposed trellis frame, larger tank extenders with um, contrasting colors, repositioned instrument cluster, black painted handlebar, smaller rear section, higher mounted LED blinkers, full color TFT, now that's a big deal for me, LED front light like Super Duke, larger 13.4 liter fuel tank so congratulations to all those tourers out there new upside down forks by wb new right by wire throttle as i had mentioned larger front disc uh, that is 320 mm adjustable brake and clutch levers and an exhaust the upgraded engine delivers two newton meters more torque and now the dry weight has increased by 10 kgs to 149 kgs the wheelbase has reduced by uh, 10 mm, the ground clearance has been increased by 15 mm and the seat height has been increased by 30 mm also. It was reported that KTM might add a second balance shaft to the engine cylinder head uh, to reduce its vibrations and generate extra power. However, the company has only worked on heating problem and this new engine will be able to cool faster thanks to the faster heat dissipation technology. But hey, all this comes with a price, right? Well, it mostly will be more pricey as compared to the old ones. So expect the new X showroom price somewhere between 2.10 to 2.30 lakhs. But again, I am assuming this, this might be more, this might be less, I don't know. So in India, this Street Fighter might go on sale in the first half of 2017. So yes, it is coming soon. And uh, that's about it. A lot of you guys have been asking me about this bike. So I hope this video was helpful. Let me know in the comment section below if you have any questions related to this new beast in town. And if you are watching my video for the first time, do hit that subscribe button because I do justice to a machine like this. Well, you ask me how? Then do check out my videos. Do hit the like button and stay tuned on my social pages like Facebook and Instagram for daily updates. I will see you in my next vlog at some other place. Till then, Peace out.